In this Blender tutorial I will show you how to create text in the video editor. I've assumed you have some knowledge of editing in Blender. A link to my beginners tutorial is included in the description below for those that don't. Other tutorials can be found in my playlists. I should be using Blender version 2.8 um, and also 2.81 um, is very similar if you're uh, using the beta version. So the first thing you need to know about the text um, editor in the video editor is it's very basic. So if you're going to do anything more complicated than just simple text, I would do it in 3D view. But anyway, if you want to use the text editor in the video editor, you need to go to something like add or hold down um, shift A and left click on text and this will bring some very small text up, it will actually say text right to the middle bottom. Now you can drag the length that you want your text to last for, bearing in mind that these aren't times, they're numbers of frames and with the text box showing, what I would do is first of all in the size just increase your text up in size by dragging the size up so you can actually see what you're looking at. And then in the text box where it says text, just type in the word or words you're going to use. Now I'm going to use show you something a little bit different, so I'm only going to put the first word in. I'll put the second word in in a minute. So that's brought up this word and the font is terrible. So I'm going to change the font. If you come to the little tab here it'll say open. Left click on open and this is where you'll need to know where your fonts are stored on your system or in my case I've actually gone to the trouble of actually creating a font folder. Um, some of the fonts I've used are um, I've downloaded from the internet. Now if you want to see what your fonts look like left of AZ there's a little uh, thumbnail button. So I'll select this one and then left click on open and you can see here it's changed the colour of or the style of font so let's increase this in size a bit so it sort of fills up the screen. Now you can change the locations horizontally and vertically here I wouldn't bother, I, I would use the XY um, location so X being left to right and Y is up and down so I'm going to move this up for now to the top by dragging Y over and that's fine. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to actually go left click on add again and put another text bar in. We'll drag this up to match this one here and again increase in size a bit so I can see what I'm doing and change the text change the font and start moving this about a bit so let's drag this one up to about there maybe increase it in size just a little bit select the bottom one and I'll bring it down in fact, I think I'll move the other one down a bit as well. And that gives you roughly it gives you an idea of what you can do. You can also uh, cast the shadow if you want by placing a tick in the box. Where it says shadow, I won't bother. You can change the colour of your uh, font or your but you'll have to do them individually if you've done it like this by uh, left clicking on the white bar and 
drag in your color over if you want I should just set this back to white um, and the only other thing you can do well obviously you can place a video underneath this and the video will show in the background or an image or if you want a plain color go to add then left click on color it will probably put the strip above your uh, text you'll need to bring it to the bottom should just snap and then again drag this out and it should just snap to this and again using the color strip you can change the background color so I don't know let's go blue and as I said at the beginning I assume you've got some knowledge of editing so I won't go into rendering or anything so I'll leave it at that hopefully this helps somebody thank you for watching cheers